Traveling wave tube is an electric vacuum device intended for generation and amplification of microwave oscillations. For these purposes, the device uses the interaction between a traveling electromagnetic wave and the flow of electrons, the direction of which coincides with the direction of the wave. As a result of this interaction, the wave is amplified. Traveling wave tube consists of the following elements. The electron gun that creates a directed flow of electrons of a certain density. System of focusing and formation of the electron flow. This process is implemented with the help of static magnetic and electric fields. As a result of the longitudinal magnetic field exposure, the necessary cross-section of electron flow is provided. Slow waving structure. It propagates an electromagnetic wave which interacts with electrons. This system represents a helix between the dielectric roads. It has good heat conductivity as powerful tubes get warm greatly and have to be cooled down, as well as a collector to accumulate the electrons which have passed through the interaction space. The absorber in the form of a road made of an absorbing material. To eliminate system, self-excitation can be provided as well. The main part of the device is mounted in an airlight container and the magnets of the focusing system are mounted externally. What is the operation principle of such a tube? Slow waving system ensures the equality of longitudinal velocity of electrons and the phase velocity of the wave. In these conditions, each electron moves slowly in regard to the field of traveling wave, staying mainly in the inhibiting or accelerating phase of its electric field at large length, reaching several tenths of slow wave length. Thus, an electron moves synchronously with the wave, but under the influence of accelerating positive half-wave and inhibitory negative half-wave parts of the electric field, the electrons group in bunches. These bunches are arranged in those parts of the field where the half-wave accelerating electrons turns into an inhibiting one. If the speed of the wave and electrons is equal, then there is no exchange of the energy between them and no amplification, but if the electron velocity slightly exceeds the wave velocity, the electron bunches are running the wave enter into the inhibitory space of the field and decelerate under its influence. Thus, the kinetic energy lost by electrons during inhibition turns into the energy of the traveling wave. That is how amplification in tubes of the O-type takes place. There is also an M-type tubes that have a slightly different structure. The perfect interaction between particles and waves inside them is achieved by equality of their velocities, and the film gets not kinetic energy released as a result of inhibition of electrons, but their potential energy. Tube of the type M consists of an ejecting device and an interaction space. Ejecting device is a set of cathode and controlling electrode, which creates an electron beam in the interaction space. This phase consists of inhibiting and absorbing systems, a collector and input and output waveguides. The type M tube grouping is achieved as a result of electron drift in crossed electric and magnetic fields. The transverse electric field of the slow wave leads to longitudinal drift and the formation of electron bunches around zero points of the field, where the longitudinal electric field of the wave has maximum value and inhibits the electrons. As a result, these bunches give their potential energy to the wave and at the same time continue drifting towards slow wave structure. Most often, traveling wave tube is an amplifier of broadband microwave oscillations in the range from 300 MHz to 300 GHz. It is used in receiving and transmitting devices.